Hi guys, my name is Marcus. I'm an MTT coach of the Academy of Poker and we have a great offer for you. Our current Academy of Poker course will only cost you 200 euros, but if you do it the right way, you can even get it for free. All you have to do is hit the link in the description below, get in contact with our managers and you can start right away. And now, enjoy the upcoming video. What's up guys, this is Marcus, your MTT coach of the Academy of Poker with another explanatory video. And for today I thought, uh, because I was asked during the stream a few times now um, what kind of programs I am using and as you saw, talked about uh, Stars Caption for a little bit. So I thought, yeah, why not also talk about the program I'm using for... Um, yeah, placing my tables as you see it, it pops up automatically and uh, you can do some do some fixed layouts and stuff so yeah, i thought i'll just share it with you and i'm talking about mosaic um i found it uh through a friend pretty much uh who yeah told me about you how he used this and he kind of liked it so i tried it out it has a one month trial which is already nice but even the rest isn't too expensive i think i pay um 40 45 dollars for the whole year or so so it's not that much and it kind of helps you a lot so not only and i will just quickly go through everything here not only do you have like some fixed um displays you can use you can also as you see go for uh, because i'm using two displays or uh, two monitors right now you can do like um rules and how you want to uh, distribute the tables here and you can see you can put a fixed amount so as you can see i can change the rules if i want to over here or just evenly distribute everything and as i said add a lot of rules as you can see there's many many things you can go for and you can just change the stuff so you can see you can uh, put the amount you want to put eight eight different windows on display one or you want to put it on display two and it just does the thing for you which is pretty nice so in that way as you can see it gets kind of easy also and you already see it uh, behind me you have the the layup so far and i can show it to you quickly over here this is how it looks um, when i'm streaming um, because i'm using gg poker tables as well and the gg poker tables are a bit bigger that's why this small gap is over here because it is used to the gg one so i don't have any overlapping but if i play six tables it looks like this and how it changes as well i can show it to you pretty quickly see if i just close one you have this extra thing on the side here where you can always go for the auto arranging um or you just go for arrange now and then you see it just chooses uh, the best way it is shown same for four tables and so on and so forth and of course also does the same if you just add some more tables it needs a few seconds and it finds out, oh, there's new tables. Let me arrange that for you. And as you see, it just does everything for you. And that way, it is pretty nice to go for it. And as you see, it doesn't even have uh, any kind of problems with more tables to go for. It puts it in the best way possible. And of course, as you see with 12 tables, uh, the way we have it, it is still pretty good to see. But even if we put a 13th table on there, and as you, if you know about me, as you see, it's still good. It's pretty nicely possible to see everything. There's quite some overlapping, as you see over here. But you can see the action still on every table. So this is what I like a lot about this. Of course, it gets a bit different when you, um, when you start using. Let me close the tables again here. Uh, when you start. Uh, start using different um, softwares then it gets of course a bit tricky and of course you saw the short key here uh, to use uh, just go for alt t for example and as you see you have the fixed layouts that i'm using the, just called it six tables you can also show the table placement and uh, yeah let's quickly go to the settings again to show you what is what is possible what other things are possible and for example you can, for example, align the tables so you see the small gap in here, and now I'm not going to do it because I want to keep my, want to keep my current thick uh, layout here. But as you can see, you can put it down a little bit, put it everything aligned in the center, so it would close the gap in this way over here. Uh, but as you see, if you see like, okay, I don't want to have it in the top, everything I can, you can put it down a little bit, and we'll switch down to the bottom. And for example. As you see here as well, you can put the sides, the limits, and it's and as you see, the different um, poker sides have different fonts or different sizes for their tables. It's not always the easiest, and as you if you know 
or if you play on different sides, you know the struggle sometimes. Like party poker is a bit smaller than poker stars. GG poker's table are way bigger than the average uh, poker stars table. And I mean, you can just see it here. It's 491 times 366. And this is 498 times 374. It doesn't seem like a lot, but it, it is quite quite hard then to align it everything in the best possible way so uh, that's why this helps a lot and uh, yeah just so many different things you can choose for icc you can also just choose one of the tables and now i just took the mini sipper tuesday as a example table here and you can even go for customized size whatever you want to do and maybe you could even try to go for the exact same sizing that gg poker has and all those different things as as good as it is possible, of course, for all the sites, because some sites do not uh, have the specific sizes you want, but you can try around a little bit and uh, then just try it the best way you have it. And I mean, you see it in the streams. For me, it works pretty nicely now. I have like the, like my uh, screen size is the one of the GG poker tables, uh, but the poker size tables just have a little bit or a little bit left on one of, this, one of the tables. So that is totally fine. As you can see, what you can also do when you rank the tables, because as you see, if I get a new table, it might be might be going to the top left instead of the bottom right. This is because on the one side it is, it is um, put alphabetically, but you can also choose to go for buy-in by big blind or just if you want manually. So probably going to go by buy-in here, and of course in the order as well, from from top to bottom or from bottom to top, whatever you want. And as you see, in some new stuff. As you see, okay, if there's a new table, yeah, I want to reorder it, of course. If you want a different rank, I could do that as well. If, if the table is closed, I want to reorder, hmm, not sure, we'll see. And all those different kinds of things, which is kind of nice. And uh, then the last, which I think is pretty interesting or which is pretty um, good to use, is if you want to swap positions. Because, for example, I have in the top of my screen, I have the GG tables. On the bottom, I have the stars tables. And in case it does change around i can just swap positions and mosaic does not change it back because it sh it's it recognizes that i want it to have it like this and as you see you can also just go for the placement nothing too spectacular here of course but always nice to have obviously also some of the hotkeys you want to use i have the old t but of course you can also change it uh, for maybe some some simpler ones if you want to and uh, yeah also as you can see here what you want to be hand what you want to have handled with and then you see all the different kinds of ones uh, you can also ignore some windows if you want to and this is i mean it's pretty easy to use not uh, nothing no witchcraft over here uh, and yeah therefore i like i like to see it also as you see you can make some uh, if you have want some borders you can see what kind of tournaments there are so yeah quite a lot of things and yeah, about the information and all those kinds of things. Also, of course, the support. Um, for example, when I installed it, my uh, my payment didn't get, go through at first, but it, it really quickly went through um, when I went, I got to Discord. They have a Discord support that is pretty fast. So that was pretty nice and yeah, also really fast. But yeah, other than that, there's not that much more to explain, actually. Uh, it's pretty easy and as you see, it does most of the stuff for its own and I kind of used the uh, like a basic basic setting didn't change too much uh, but it works perfectly i really like it and um, that it puts everything in the correct order and um yeah as you see for like four dollars a month pro right right around uh it helps you massively with your sessions because you don't have to put up the tables uh on your own it just does it for you and you can keep on grinding and don't even have to think about um, yeah, what, where do I put this one now? Oh, I have two other tables open where, where I have some action. This is getting, this is like maybe a bit too stressful for some people. So therefore, I really, really like this. And yeah, this is also already going to be it for today's uh, explanatory video. Thanks for tuning in, guys. As always, I wish you a great day. I wish you good luck at the tables. And then we'll see each other in the next video. Bye.